Hello everybody and welcome. My name is Tigress Lily and welcome back to Babel's Painting. This time uh, we're actually trying to go for the alternate endings. Uh, now in Babel's Painting there actually is no good or bad ending. There is just alternate endings. Um, there's also one little extra, like it's a different kind of gameplay called the Extra Scenario. Um, I think that one only comes out after you uh, beat the last ending, which I think is the real me? I'm not sure. But either way, yeah. This is going to be a bit of a longer one that's probably going to be like Eve and probably going to get split into two different parts because... In order to get these endings, you practically have to play through the entire game all over again and almost each and every time have to do something different. Instead of cat. So yeah, this may get a little longer and a little more convoluted, but yeah. Anyway, let's get started. Just so you know, the one that we got, uh, the long dream, is the most common one as basically you're playing through the entire game as a, almost as if it was meant to be played. You're putting the mirror shard there, you're dropping the scissors down the thing, you're using the, um, the candle on the vines to get the black paint and then going through the door after you're painting the door. So yeah. Anyway, yeah, the long dream is actually the most common one, and in order to get it, you have to basically just play it how I played it. Go into the shed without that lit candle. So yeah. Anyway, this next one's gonna be called And I'm Gone. I'll get I'll show you how to do it in one moment. Alrighty then, everyone. This is gonna be where we start off with uh and I'm gone. Uh this is one of the endings in Bavel's painting. Um, basically, for this... Oh, hold up. There we go. Okay. Um, for this, we have to have all of our items. Uh, the scissors and the mirror shard. Basically, we keep our scissors. Um, da -da 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 -da. Okay. So basically, what we need to do is basically instead of dropping the scissors down, we drop down the mirror shard. Yep. Yeah. Heard a stabbing sound. Seriously, they could have just used and the music that suddenly stopped. Jeez. So yeah, saving, saving. Okay, and we go. It was so much better with the music playing. Oops. Don't be a silly. Okay then. Um, ba -da 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 -da, heading into our certain doom. The library is now replaced with skulls. And this red trippy. We got red paint. No, we didn't. Straight down. Come on. Yes. Out of the demon room. So yeah, basically we use the mirror shard to stab the lady. And we keep our scissors so that way we can keep our uh, candle for when we are heading to uh, the, the shed. Um, da -da 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 -da. I actually have yet to figure out what in the heck that lipstick was used for, but I'm pretty sure it has something to do with one of these endings. So yeah. Alright. Uh, paint. Red quote unquote paint. Paint the door red. Yes, let's paint the door red. Door is now red. Brush is now dirty. Yes, we understand that. That's kind of what happens when you start painting. Back into the black abyss full of red puddles of blood. And back into the dungeon. And let's clean the brush. Okay. Now there's actually nothing here that really needs to be done, I think. Okay, yeah, hold up. Right here. Here it is. 
No, not paints. Items. Scissors. Yes. The scissors are now broken. Gotta wait, gotta wait. We're playing the waiting game. Try not to get ourselves stabbed from the spike fall traps. Okay. Come on now. It pains in my arse. Go down. Stop. Wait for them to go back down. I hate these waiting games. They suck. The thing is, is I'm actually pretty good at them because I know how long to wait. And go. Oh! Almost got myrtleized there. I got black paint. Oh, uh, crud. Alright then everyone, actually I'm gonna pause it right here because I still need to go and get the um the candle. So I'm gonna pause it right here and I'm actually gonna meet you in front of the door before we paint it black. Okay? I'll see you in a bit. And we're back. So yeah. And once again I have to click on my thing. There we go. So yeah. We just got all of the stuff, we just killed the girl, and we got our paint back. So yeah. Let's paint this door. Black paint. Yes, let's paint this door black. I don't think we need to clean our brush again. So yeah, let's just go. Okay, so yeah. Um, just so everyone knows, yes, I am actually using a walkthrough for this because, like I said, these things are. Con I'm trying to talk here. These things are convoluted. Like, you have to do specific things. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. So yeah. Let's see here. All right, we're now in the dark world. We have our lit candle. Let's get this empty jar here. Bottle, grab the battery. Got the battery. Let's see. What else needs to be done? Um, okay, pretty much that's all you need to do. So. Okay, so um, I need to run through this entire level once again. So um, once again, I'm gonna jump cut ahead. I'm gonna pause the g pause my recording, jump ahead, and I will see you in a bit. Toodles. Alrighty, and I am back. We have collected what we needed, and yeah, we have everything we need for this area. I still have no idea what this needs. What I need for this. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, don't touch it. Items. Uh, lit candle. We're burning the painting. Uh, 
And that is a bright red screen. Am I back? No? I'm not. End! And I'm gone! So yeah, that was the first ending. Um, well, second ending if you count uh, the long dream ending. But yeah. So yeah, that was And I'm Gone. Next up is going to be Dead Inside. So yeah, be right back. Alright everyone, this time we are going for the ending uh, Dead Inside. It's basically the same thing as what we were already doing with um, And I'm Gone. We drop the mirror shard down into uh, the toolbox, keep the scissors, but this time instead of getting the red paint, uh, we are supposed to, I mean the red paint, the black paint, we're supposed to uh, burn the door. And I finally figured out what the lipstick was for. Making this canvas red with the lipstick. Because for some reason, this painting over here, I actually am using the Beverly's uh, thing that comes with the game, and the sign said, make it red. So, I'm not really 100% sure what that means. Maybe it's a different way of getting out? I'm not sure. But yeah, that's what the lipstick is for, is to paint that canvas red. Not quite sure what good it would do me, but that's what it's for. But yeah. I know I actually never got the paint, the black paint. Um, however, what, later in this game, if you uh, remember in my playthrough, uh, our alternate, the other me that's here, the one with the black hair instead of the gray hair, the one we killed in the game, um, jumps out of a painting. If you go back, you can grab her canvas without her actually, with, uh, without actually needing to get the black paint. Which means you don't have to end up killing her. Which is awesome. You know, all the kids are dead though. Yay? I don't know. Is silly. But yeah. We have everything we need. So yeah. Head on up. This is the door. That'd be the door. So, items. Lit candle. And we light the door on fire. Door was burned black. Okay, something tells me it's not going to be the same, so... I don't know, I think I might keep recording on this one. So far, it's the same. Yeah, you still talk to me and ignore me. Hmm. <laughs> well, so far everything seems to be the same. Mansion's the same. Apparently I have to go into the, uh, the fireplace. So I'm gonna save it. I'll grab this thing just in case. Get the empty bottle. I never know when I'm gonna need it. Now it says I have to go up to like the, hold on, do I still have my candle? Of course not. Why is it that after I use it, it goes away? That's just silly. But yeah, hopefully in this one I won't have to actually activate McDoucher Nuts over there. That's the Reaper that we activated in the main game. He is a pain in the butt to deal with. Okay... This is the only fireplace I know about. Too dark to see anything. So I don't know what the point of this was. Hmm. 
Okay, and then so drop the mirror, share it in the tour box, keep the scissors. Use the candle, keep the lit thing with the scissors. I have the scissors. How do I get into the fireplace? Okay, pausing it until I figure this out. See you in a bit. Yeah, that's it. Walk away. Hello. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, then I figured out what I was doing wrong. I tried to play a bit into the game, into this level. Turns out I had to place duck at. Duck at on the canvas. Yay! Mm, let me see. Okay. Oh, shh, forgot about that. For a moment, I thought something appeared behind me. You got a little faster. Not much, though. There's still no match for my speed. Some dramatic music for a whole lot of nothing. Still not scary. Come in already. Still, it's pretty awesome music. All right, yeah, that bastard's gone. Okay. Heading back up the stairs. Downstairs. Um, yeah. Sorry guys, I'm still I'm reading the walker to figure this out because um I haven't done anything with the fireplace yet. Uh, which room is it supposed to be in then? Top rightish. If I didn't kill the bell in the red world, I didn't. After placing duck at, a note will appear in the top rightish room of. 2F. Okay then, so, wrong room. Completely and totally. There's supposed to be red footprints behind it? I don't know which one is 2F, though. I assume that just means second floor. Oh, you! I gotcha. Run away from here. That's new. Something under the note? Yes. Tear off that note. Press the switch. Yes. Okay, and we caused an earthquake. Okay, and heard the sound from the lower floor. And nothing just remains the picture of the door being burnt.
What's wrong with you, young man? Making weird noises. Would you stop running around like a freaking lunatic? Jeez. Yes, I'm talking to you, young man. My cat's being weird. Young man, do not make d Young man. You and the blinds. Young man. Young man. Hold up for a second. I have to go kick him. Get out of here. Shoot. When in doubt, just whip a plastic bag at him. Okay, then. Very noisy chair. There's a ladder down in the fireplace. Yay! Go down? Why not? This is new. Uh... Clean your plate. Apparently I don't want it. Huh? Oh! Why do bears constantly want to try and kill me? And I haven't even played Five Nights at Freddy's yet. Jeez. I thought I got you away from the door. I'm leaving. What? I got a cleaning fluid. Whatever the heck that means. Door? Nope. Now I... Okay. Okay. Okay, so I gotta be really careful. I don't even know what's going on. I don't know what's going on at all. Maybe if I ignore the meat? I gotta look at the plate, don't I? Yep. I don't know what you're saying. Okay, then I paused the game real quick to actually see what the guy was saying, because I am looking at a uh, image from uh, the Bevelese. Basically, he's saying, why won't you eat? I'm like, because I'm full. I've already had my meats and veggies for the day. What if I just kind of go back into the fireplace? It won't let me. Ah! Run away from the bear! I'm not hungry. Okay, come over here. Get the cleaning fluid. Just to try and go through the hole? Nope. Ugh, she kills me anyway. Okay then, hold on. Pausing the game, I'll be right back. Or not, never mind. Turns out what I was going to try and do didn't work anyway, so yeah. Or maybe I can just try this? Does that work? No. I just ended back in this place. Okay, then I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing with this thing. Hmm. To look at this. I don't want it. Do I have to replay the game and not eat the meat? No, that won't work. Alright, come on, Chef Freddy. Hey. Get over here, you blue bitch. Cleaning fluid. 
Get away from me. There's nothing over there I can go through. Let's get back in here. Apparently the skull won't follow me in here. skull is. Ah! That's what I had to do. Okay. Let's look around. First. Okay then, so this is where that dirty door was. Okay. Alright, so... For this ending, we gotta stab the heart. Hold on. No. Items. Scissors. black screen. What? I'm the black haired Bella? Uh, Bavel? Bella, yeah. music zoomed in on the stabbed heart and dead inside all right that was uh, ending number three i believe Hold on, one, two, yeah ending number three number four it's gonna be meaningless illusion i probably completely messed up by that yeah i probably did oh well whatever and dead inside. Alright, see you in the next one. Alright everyone, uh, we are on ending number four, I think? Is it one dream? Yeah, meaning number four. This one's called Meaningless Illusion. Uh, in order to do this one, basically, doesn't really matter which path you go, as long as you end up here, with, with the fireplace ending, which means you can't kill our alternate ego in the red world. For Meaningless Illusion, we're entering the dirty door. Yes. Okay. That breathing is annoying. Makes me think of Darth Vader. What? A lacquer? A lacquer? White screen. And... Am I tumbling out of a locker on the other side? I am. Someone shoved me in a locker. End. Meaningless illusion. Well, that was boring. <laughs> Not really boring, just weird. Anyway, the next one's going to be called uh, Rousing Success. Not quite sure what that means, but yeah, we'll find out what it, what's going on with that. See you in a bit.